What's up? This your girl Naima Supreme, and you're watching PalTV.net. Naima, what's up? You got your your mixtape out right now. You gonna talk about the mixtape? My mixtape is called Bad, and mm -hmm. you know it's got a lot of great tracks on it. I got about three videos out for it: a House Party, None of Your Business, and Real Talk One on One, which is actually the first song off of it. And bad just represents, you know, just me and my style, you know, everything that I stand for. I'm kind of a rebel, but, you know, I'm a good girl, kind of. Alright, so yeah, you say your style is, like, different, like a rebel. Like, what's up with the hair? Like, I've never seen a, a hairstyle like that. It's very original. Like, my who came braids. up with it? Yeah. Um, it was actually, like, one day my hair was messed up, and I'm like... I gotta do something with it, you know, so I put two braids in it and I got a lot of compliments. So since then I've just been playing with different braid styles. This one I kind of just connected along the edge and just put like a, a long dramatic braid, but you know, I love doing my hair. I actually do it to myself, but it's just a, you know, it's part of my style. The supremacy braid is called. The supremacy, so you gotta trademark it for someone else steal it. Right. <laughs> oh man, so. You down with the whole slow bucks movement and everything. I see you with them heavy. Like, how did that whole thing start? Um, I actually knew slow bucks from back in the day before it was slow and bucks together. You know, mm -hmm. I'm from Queens and so are they. So just growing up, you know, I had contact with them. And um, when they started their their whole slow bucks company, I was also starting out as an artist. So you know, we just had that connection as friends. So they definitely looked out for me and gave me a couple of great looks with the Jim Jones, Everybody Jones video song. Um, summer Jam, you know, they, they put me in a lot of good positions. So, how did the whole Jim Jones thing happen? And um, actually, I used to work for Jewels as his assistant, and then, um, so I, I was just introduced to Jim from just being around, and then one day I saw him, he asked me, you know, what are you doing? I told him I was into the whole music thing, so he wanted to hear what I, you know, had going on. So I came to the studio and laid down a couple of tracks, and he was impressed, so he had me do something for Everybody Jones on the album. All right, cool. Can you cook? Yes. Like, what's your favorite uh, dish to cook? Um, my mom actually likes my steak. She, you know, she's always begging me to season the steak and cook it. But I can make steak, <clears throat> spaghetti. I don't really make breakfast, but I can do dinner. You know, uh, salmon. Nobody eats breakfast anymore. That's all we. <laughs> <laughs> I can do a good salmon and broccoli, or uh, <laughs> I can cook whatever. I'm good with the seasoning here, so. I don't think someone agrees with you over here. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, man, so people have been kind of like playing female hip hop like in the last year, but I kind of think that it's getting better. There's a lot of new artists. I'm seeing it's you, it's Brianna. It's like a whole bunch of new artists that I, I kind of rock with. Like, what do you think about the state of female hip hop right now? Uh, I like that so many girls are coming out, you know, the woodwork. I could just look on Twitter and every day I see a new girl who's rapping or a new girl who's popping. And mm -hmm. I appreciate that. It's kind of, you know, instead of seeing a thousand guys who are, you know, not not to knock the hustle, but it's just nice seeing a lot of girls being, you know, appreciated and looked at and acknowledged. Okay. If you were a, a Disney character, like, what, who would you be? Um, maybe... Jasmine <laughs> from Aladdin. Okay, why why Jasmine? She was kind of a princess girl, but you know, she had to be tough. Kind of reminds me of myself. It was a favorite movie of mine, also. So I always loved Jasmine. All right, cool. So let's get back to the mixtape. Like to get to know you as a person, what's the best track that we should listen to? The best track is number one and it's called that's me and it's a it's it's a description of you know of some of the things i've been through as a child with my family through music you know just me growing up and the reason why i am who i am make today. sure you check out my new video juice and um juice is a you know it's a fun swaggy kind of song swaggy kind of video i'm doing a lot of dance scenes and performance scenes in that and um, i come from a dance background so hip-hop dancing is really big for me so make sure you check it out and enjoy it